Ollie, a goal today and a point away at Doncaster. It's a very good point. You must be quite happy as a squad. Yeah, definitely, yeah, especially with uh, such a bad start to the game and them scoring so early. Uh, it gave them a lot of momentum, but I think we handled that really well. Uh, kept in the game, played some good football, had some good chances, yeah, glad to get on the score sheet and get us a point. And if there were any neutrals in the ground, it, it would have been a good one for the neutral. It was a good game of football, wasn't it? Yeah, definitely. I think they're both teams that like to get the ball down and uh, play good stuff. It's not always um, about the about the points, it's performance aspect as well. I think both teams uh, value that a lot. So yeah, it was an enjoyable game to play. Rochdale's style of play is this possession and, and patient build-up. Were you surprised how much space you got at the point when you scored? Because it just sort of opened up in front of you. Uh, yeah, but I think uh, I think that comes not just from on the ball stuff, off the ball work. Like we were massive on our fitness work here. We got Kevin Gibbons and Ben Eakins who are top form in that department, and they train us really hard. So I feel like we grow into games a lot, and I think that's where it comes from, really. Is it about just having a, a, a shot from distance a little bit more often and see if you can uh, pick up the bottom corner again? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think so. I'd love to add uh, more goals to my game, but I obviously uh, I like I do a lot of work off the ball as well. I help win it back and feeding it to other players as well, so it's, so it's nice to always uh, chip in. We, we've just spoke to the manager about that, and I know you've said before you want to add more goals to yeah. the game. That's, that's your third of the season, yeah. second in the league. So is it something that you want to try and get more of? Yeah, definitely, yeah. Uh, I think, um, obviously, I've, I've not had a long run in the side for a few months now with uh, injury and stuff, so hopefully I can uh, stay fit now and um, crack on. We just had a, a quick chat with, with Matty Lund, he made yeah. his uh, second or third debut for the club <laughs> there. Uh, what was it like playing alongside uh, Lundy? Yeah, uh, class, I've got a lot of respect for Lundy um, as a player and as a, as a lad. Like uh, When I first came to Rochdale, um, he was like someone that kind of took me under the win wing a bit. Uh, I stayed with him in like the pre-season trip to Tenerife and he was good as gold for me. So yeah, he's a great lad and a good player. And now a, a game at, at the Stadium of Light on Tuesday. It's a, it's a big stadium up there. There'll be a, a very vocal home support. You've just got to go there and, and play your game, haven't you? Yeah, we'll go there and express ourselves. Like We've done it a lot of uh, big stadiums this season, like Old Trafford swings to mind. We went there and played our style and got a result. So hopefully we can do the same up there. Do you play up to the big stadiums, big occasions? Yeah, definitely. For a club like Rochdale to go to a Stadium of Light on Tuesday, it's huge. Like. It just shows like how well Rochdale are doing, and uh, I think it's always a night you can really look forward to. When you picked that ball up earlier, was there just one thing? As soon as you got it, you uh, knew what yeah. you were doing. Uh, yeah, <laughs> Hendo's got a beautiful first touch, and I just timed it off him. I knew he'd find me, and I just drove forward. Kind, of, I think I had two runners either side, and the centre half kind of went with them, and it just opened up for me. And there was, yeah, no other, no other decision. One thing we, we seem to know, speaking of players looking on the pitch, is a great team cohesion, perhaps perhaps in your time than there's ever been it seems particularly this time last year when Doncaster beat you 5-0 it, it must have yeah. all been pretty low uh, yeah yeah. the last couple of years we've not had uh, good results here but I think all the lads have really bought into Brian's style and his, his man management and um, he, he's got everybody on board and hopefully can keep picking up uh, more points as the season goes on what's he been like with you personally what have you found his, his good qualities with you yeah um, he's given me a lot of belief um, He's not just spoke about my off the ball work, he's given me a lot of belief in on the ball and I can be the person that creates chances, score goals and when you know you've got a manager uh, supporting you like that, um, it means a lot.